So when it comes to templates, there's a few reasons that you may need a template. You don't have to, you can create a session for your song and set it all up and go. You'd be fine doing that. But there are a few scenarios which we need them. When we're doing a tracking session at a studio like Blackbird, where we're bringing in a lot of musicians and we finished the first song, now it's time to go to song number two. It would be a huge bummer if I had to tell everybody they had to wait while I built a new session from scratch and create all those tracks and name them and color code them and all those other things that would hold up the session. But if I create a session and know that it's going to be my template for everything else that's happening that day, because our drummer's there, our bass player's there, we've got the same mics going through the same channels of the console, going into the same input numbers of Pro Tools and everything kind of stays the same for our visit there then why sort of reinvent the wheel and why create a session from scratch every single time? We'll make a template session and then we will take that and we'll save it as the next song every time we need to do another song. Now, the reason we do a new session for each song is that even though all the inputs are going to be the same, the same microphones and all that stuff for the most part, we would still like to keep those songs separate because they might not all have the exact same instrumentation. And when it comes time to mix, we may want to treat uh, maybe with plugins or, or however we're going to mix it. It might be a specific thing for each song. Now, another reason that you may need a template is even at your home studio. One of the biggest kind of buzz kills that you can have is all of a sudden you're inspired to do something. You go into your studio and by the time you get everything working and you've had to play engineer and create this session and tracks and name them and get the routing and all that other stuff done. By the time that's there and you've got everything working, maybe the inspiration has left. So you might want to have a template ready to go that facilitates you just getting right to work and creating. And you shouldn't in those situations really worry about, you know, is this the right color for this track or am I using the right this or that? It's more about getting the idea down. So if you have a template, and maybe you go so far as to always have a certain mic set up. Then when you boot that up, it's ready to go. You can start creating, get your idea down and not have to play engineer for, you know, however long before you actually get to start being creative.